How's it going YouTube? AUS Aviation 149 here, ready to do a whole host of unboxings today. I've got five coming for you. Um, so let's start off with the first one. See my new Phoenix um, Virgin Australia Airbus A33200 in the new Virgin Australia livery. And um, this is my first Airbus model. Generally, I'm more of a Boeing fan. I just I don't know, to me personally, Airbuses don't seem to have much of a wow factor. I mean, that's just my own opinion. Because, um, yeah, I don't know. People like the A380, but in my opinion, that's just a glorified double-decker bus. Um, I shouldn't really say that, but anyway, I'm just more of a buying fan. But I do. Lo I bought this one because I really am a fan of the new Virgin Australia livery. So I thought, oh, well, we'll get an Airbus model eventually, and I thought this would be the one. Because I really am a fan of uh, the Virgin Australia brand. Um, I've flown on them a couple of times and also on the International Leg V Australia, so I thought I'd get this to complement the fleet. So let's get on with the unboxing. It's a pretty small box, this one. It's about the same size as the uh, 787 box, so I think it's Phoenix's new A330 mould, so it's very detailed. Alright, and we'll set it up on my new runway. Take it so yeah, as you can see, a very detailed model in this. I really like the shape of the Phoenix A330 mould, and just the new Virgin Australia logo looks really nice. I do like this. It looks very classy. See, um... Virgin rebranded themselves from a low-cost carrier as Virgin Blue to the new Virgin Australia primarily to compete with Qantas because Qantas ever since Anzac collapsed has pretty much cornerstoned the Australian business travel market so they've completely rebranded themselves um, into a premium airline to try and capture back their market and they've been making serious inroads into our <clears throat> Qantas's Travellers, they've been doing. They've been getting consistently good reviews. Then you've got a whole host of new aircraft, including these A330s. Well, I say new, but they're actually um, ex Emirates aircraft, and they're over ten. Year, they're about ten years old, but um, they've also got new ones on order. So these are just, I think, to fill the gap until they arrive. But um, they've been making some serious inroads, like offering things such as matching one for one. Um, if a Qantas frequent flyer has, say, gold status, then Virgin will, for a limited time, they'll match match that status in their Velocity Rewards program, so they've certainly made some inroads. But back to the model anyway, very nice looking mould. It's got a very detailed front end with the, uh, I believe it's the antenna on the top there. Moving back forward, the engines, I believe they're Rolls-Royce engines. I think I may be wrong, I'm not sure. Um, but either way, they're very detailed, as you can see. You've got the thrust reverses painted into the side there with the red stripe. Looks very classy, this livery, like the V Australia one. Red winglet tip and um, very detailed wings as well. It's a bit hard to see at the moment, but uh, yeah, they're in there. And then you've got the Virgin logo. Very, cl I like the look of the Virgin logo on the all-white body and the tail fin. And the registration of this one is... VH-XFB, like I said, X Emirates A330s. Because we all know they like to switch their aircraft up quite a bit. But then you've got the APU section in the back. Spinning around to the other side. And then just looking at it from the other side. But yeah, overall, a very fan a detailed model. I'm quite glad I got this to complement my Virgin Australia planes. Uh, sorry, not Virgin, V Australia planes. Because I'm a fan of the Virgin... Uh, Airlines in Australia, and um, I just thought, yeah, about time to get an Airbus model. And I, I like the look of this one and the livery, so quite glad to get that. Alrighty, guys, thanks for watching this one. Please rate, comment, and subscribe if you like the video, and uh, be sure to check out my other unboxings, which will be coming up very soon. See you guys.